Hello everybody, welcome back to more 7 Days to Die. As always, this is Jason, and um, I'm going to do some of the quests for um, the Minuteman, just to get him out of the way here. Uh, so, we're going to do this one to go over to this nursery. The green something nursery. Green. Green. Um, so... I just had a weird experience, so I fast traveled to that plane that we're not at now, the one I'm walking towards right now, um, and it was immediately under attack, which was fine, because it was just some raiders, and then there was some ghouls that had names, like Mr. Donahue and all this, and then I accidentally hit one of my G keys, uh, G12 or something, on my keyboard here, and it, uh, it loaded... It loaded an old save. I guess last time I quick saved, did a quick load. So, uh, yeah, we're back here, and I decided not to travel to this plane because it didn't go so well for me just a minute ago. I don't know if there's anything in here, oh, there's a carrot. We got a carrot. I believe. Yeah, Mrs. Oh, I see. Hmm, that was their names before they they were in a plane crash, I guess. Kind of curious. No chance of hitting one of these things. Not very high. But supposedly that'll kill her. Oh shit! Jesus Christ, Mr. Mrs. Parker, Mr. Parker. Oh Jesus Christ, Mr. Parker. Okay, that didn't go as well as I wanted it to. Mrs. Parker. She's probably pissed off what I did to Mr. Parker. There's one more coming from that direction. Mr. Summer. Mr. Summer's known for his back attacks. He's fast, too. He's a fast motherfucker. Right, Mr. Summer. Actually, you know what? If you're still alive, you should be dead right there, though. Bam, Mr. Summer. Anybody else? Alright. Mr. Parker carries around oven mitts, spoons, and 10 millimeter rounds. I needed those. Okay. Alright, dog meat. We killed them all. So what were they protecting? Anything? Another carrot? What? By, by chance? Oh wait, that was the same one I already checked. So what's in this one? T-shirt and slacks. Oh, a safe. No way I could. Expert, this. huh? All right. All right. A locked suitcase. Great. Some laundered loungewear. Okay, so I, I mean, at least it's laundered, right? So it's clean. Things are strewn out in this plane rack. It's strange. Who are you mad at? Oh, shit. Mr. Donaghy, you just got messed up by dog meat. I 
I wonder if I should be grabbing this, uh, oh, that brain fungus I'm gonna grab. Bingo. A percent more damage against murlocs. Mmm, the murdicks are going down, buddy. That was a name brand coffee pot. Good old rat away in here, which we need to complete that other quest we were just talking about. Okay, there's radiation somewhere. I don't know what that always means. I mean, obviously it means that there's radiation, but uh, sometimes it means there's um, a fusion thing. Oh. Ooh, what do I can do with that? Oh man, those fusion cells are tiny. I wonder how many of those I've missed over time. Okay. The radiation was like... Right here. Um, let's take a... A, a thing. If we can figure out where the radiation is coming from. Huh. Where do you reckon it's coming from? I keep seeing something flying over there. I can't uh, hit Q on it there. I can't get this hill either. Here we go, I finally did it. Huh. Well, they've done a good job of hiding this radiation. Or the source of it. Hmm. I guess it's just coming off of this plane somewhere. That I can't actually see. Blood leaf. What that is. Appears to grow in water there. Really curious about the radiation still. But I don't look, I'm gonna get my answer here. There's a way into there. What'd you find? What did you find? He's not getting there either. He wants to show me something. Was it the fungus you found? What'd you find, buddy?
All right, let's just move on here. This ain't happening. I swear that red bar keeps going up even whenever you have the rad X on. Maybe that shit's in my head. This shit's all over the place, man. It's like, it's plus 7, plus 3, plus 12. Meanwhile, I don't know what any of it's coming from. It must just be like, in the ground, man. Or something. I don't know. I don't see the source. I'm going to move on. Moving on. We're moving on. It's official. On we move. Have I been here before? This doesn't look like somewhere I've been. Okay, that's a greeter. Hello. Welcome to the General Atomics Galleria. You must be our new supervisor. Uh, yes. That's right. Splendid. <laughs> well, let me be the first to welcome you to your new assignment. Once you've had a chance to get settled in, you should report to the director. His office is located in the statue in the center of the plaza. The Galleria is currently closed to the public. But staff and employees are permitted on the grounds, of course. If you have any questions, I'd be happy to assist you. Why is the Galleria closed? I'm sorry, but due to pending litigation, I am unable to comment. Please direct your inquiries to the General Atomics Legal Affairs Division. <laughs> what is this place? The General Atomics Galleria is the shopping center of tomorrow today. Our wide array of stores are staffed entirely by the General Atomics line of robots, showcasing the reliability and versatility of a robotic workforce. Come in and experience the General Atomics difference. Who's the director? General Atomics patented director management oh system, DMS, is responsible for coordinating the actions of the robots here at the Galleria. So it's another robot? The director allows the Galleria to operate autonomously without the need for human intervention. That's all. Very well. Enjoy your visit. All employees, report suspicious behavior to the director immediately. Step right up. Okay. This is, uh... No, no. No, we won't. We won't be doing that. Oh, that's so close. Nice. here likeness one likeness two all right u-s-e-s u-s-e-s -E so we know the s on the end is one u-s-e-s it's gotta have an s on the end Yes, there we go. I'm through. 
Gallery system. The gallery is currently closed. Director management system is active. The facility supervisor is not present. Zero stores are reporting errors. Arrows. <laughs> errors. Current promotions. He permits local operators to offer manager cells. Okay, let's don't start the cells just yet. Let's get a better idea of what's going on around us. Programmer's note. This is ridiculous. I know the manager's cell provision is built into the franchise agreement, but the gallery is run entirely by robots. There is no manager. Why are we wasting development time on functionality that would never be used? <laughs> Welcome to life as a programmer. Okay. So we can come and start a cell for the managers once I'm a manager, maybe. Communists. Remember, you are the pride of General Atomics. Do you have to really give morale boosts to robots? I'm not a criminal. Then what are you? Vandal? Mercenary? Communist? Wait, the grand reopening? Are you grand reopening Supervisor 18 Alpha? You're late. <laughs> yes. Yes, that's right. Manual authorization of the grand reopening requires authentication. So I'm going to need to see your ID. Shit. Sir. Shit. Wait, manual activation? Is there any other kind? Automatic activation was scheduled for January 1st, 2078. Wait. Analyzing. Corrupt task detected. Task scheduler repaired. Now executing previously scheduled task. Accessing protocols. All units, stand by for the grand reopening. <laughs> Processing firmware updates. Done. Am I? Reinstating combat inhibitors. Done. I know what just happened. Designating new facility supervisor. Done. The General Atomics Galleria is now open for business. As the grand reopening supervisor, you will be conducting tonight's customer appreciation raffle. Here is the grand prize. That'll be all, soldier. <laughs> Thanks. Dismissed. Thanks, buddy. Great, so now I'm the supervisor. I oh, see you made it finally, dog meat. <laughs> We're going back down now. Don't push me off like you just fell. Bye. See you later. Goodbye, dog meat. Oh, don't stand on my face, please. And he's gone. Okay, so now I'm the supervisor of this place. I was hoping that holding V would let me edit it. But that's not the case. Everyone get these stores cleaned up. We got we're open for business, you know. Welcome to Happy Eats. Feel free to seat yourself. I'll be right through. Excuse me, sir. I, I'm I'm sitting here now. I ain't gonna wait no hour. You better hurry up. I will I will yelp about this place if I don't get service in the next five minutes. I think it made me yelp. I'm leaving. Your service sucked. That didn't work. Do stay out of the kitchen. Health regulations, you know. No, oh, yeah, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> Wonderful! You're just in time for today's product demonstration. Oh boy! Right 
this way, please. Okay. General Atomics, the world leader in consumer robotics. Our dependable line of Mr. Handy household robots will free you from the drudgery of housework forever. Our chores to childcare, errands to entertaining, no task is too big for Mr. Handy to handle. And our models are legendary for their reliability you, and you, you talk durability. A lot. proper servicing, your Mr. Handy can last a lifetime. We already have a Mr. Handy, For actually. Clients, General Atomics is proud to offer our Mr. Gutsy product line. Complete with the latest in high-tech military hardware. That concludes today's product demonstration. Good day! I guess there's no reason to have a cell. There's nothing to s have a cell on. I don't know why I had that key. Maybe I was just maybe I received it once I took my job. Oh, that just goes outside. Sweet. It's out here, dog meat. Does this stuff always cause radiation? It does. It does always cause radiation. So what happens if I like is there a way to get rid of it, basically? What's that do? Nothing. Okay. Well, that's good to know. This seems like a place I could fortify. But I guess not. Unless I've missed where I would do that at. I think this is the only place I haven't gone in yet. Howdy there. Hello. Come on in. You sell donuts, huh? Welcome to Slocum's Joe. Can I set you up with a nice hot cup of coffee? On the house. Yes. Sure. Well then, help yourself. Due to liability concerns, we are now a self service <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Bean. Can I barter with him? Even a nice hot cup of Joe? Mm, what else do you have? I'd offer you a selection of our world famous donuts, but I'm afraid they went stale <laughs> a few weeks ago. I'm sure I've got something around here, though. Uh, let's see. Okay. Are these things for sale? Yeah, they are. Thanks, buddy. He tried. Mm. Yeah, I guess I, we've missed quite a few of these stores, actually. It's this one. Welcome to Penelli's Bakery. Oh, Bakery. My name is Crisp. I take your order. What do you sell? This is a bakery. He doesn't seem very happy. Sure. Let's take a look. Let me know if you want anything. <laughs> no, I'm good. You're not you're not happy enough for me. Oh hi. Tor Taurus. I'm not a tourist. I'm your fucking boss, bitch. Or something. Hmm. Supervisor. Let me supervise on you. Outside. Oh no. Yes, it does actually. Okay. All right. And then the dress store. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Let me get some of these summer shorts. Oh shit. No, I don't actually want these summer shorts. I made a mistake. I made a huge mistake. Yo. Psst.
We can make all kinds of stuff here. Dog meat. Or we could get all kinds of clothes. Here we have like a fashion show. Watch their step there. Break a leg. This place must sell refrigerators as well. I don't know what the pre-war money's for. I take it always, though. It's not very heavy. Okay. Well, this is an interesting little town we've wandered into here. Last but not least, the bowling alley, I guess. Oh shit, it's its own zone. Probably where the bad guys are then, right? This has been a very uh, relaxed time. Welcome to oh, no. I'm afraid our lanes are out of order today. But feel free to take a look around. I am sorry about all this. I'm due for a good cleaning. It's been what a few hundred years. Stealth boy in there. <gasps> Jangles the moon monkey. Fuck yeah, give me Jangles the moon monkey. Hi. <sighs> oh, if I could take it. I'm sorry, sir. With the lanes closed, we're not opening for business today. I see. What happened to the lanes here? Well, that one's all wet. But I could take those actually. I can take those bowling pins. Is there bowling balls? <gasps> Fuck yeah, there are. <sighs> There's tape bear. Oh man. I've seen videos of people like shooting. There's some gun that lets you like shoot stuff out of it. You gotta find that and come bowling. Was, uh, name brand antifreeze there. What's going on back here? This light. This light though. It's weird. Please have a look around. Why does everyone keep pushing me to look around? Ain't much, ain't much to see here, buddy. Ooh. Supervisor's terminal. Mm -hmm. Security's too good. Shit. This music tells me this is what I was here to find, too. What's this? Here for your aluminum cans. Oh, and that fan. I never noticed that those open when you take stuff out of them. Alright, we gotta get the better hacking thing so we can open our own damn terminal. That's back down to here. Apparently they were just storing some bombs in the, uh, in the, in the bowling alley. You know, like you do. Oh, this is a cool little upstairs area with a bar. So I say this looks like it actually works. Look, are those eight tracks? No, nah. maybe. No. Nah. You can jive. What are we gonna get? Pick one. Are oh, you putting the same one back in? That's the one you just had, buddy. Uh, that's not as exciting. Oh man, bowls we don't have. We ain't got no twelve ball. We ain't got no five ball. We have a cue ball. We got a 15. Oh, we have an 8 ball, but I'm going to take another one. They're like novelty. Oh, we have a cute ball. Alright. There's a lot of bowling balls here. The electronic. The bathrooms. After that trap stall. 
never know what to expect in these things. Alright, well, I guess that was this town. I need to get, like I said, the next, um, the next terminal hacking so I can really see what the, what the supervisor's computer has. It's weird that they had a human supervisor here, right? Like, what's the point? I guess if we want to buy everything, we can put everything on sale, too. What'd you find, dog me? Okay. Oh, I guess I'll take that boxing glove. Thanks, dog meat. You think that the the weights weigh that much in your inventory? Um. All right, guys. Well, I guess that's going to be it for today. I hope you all have enjoyed as always, and uh, I'll see you all in the next episode tomorrow. Bye-bye.